Hello, Seesaw Nation. My name is Robin Schumacher. I am a second grade teacher and differentiation coach at Altitude Elementary in Colorado. You can follow me on Twitter at Robin underscore S-C-H-U-H. I'm going to jump into a quick and fun activity I've done for four, uh, four years now with Seesaw. It is called A Friend A Day in May. Every year I do a little something different depending on my class and what they create, but I will share that with you right now. So what we do to start our a friend a day in May is we end the year with a bang. I hang up the number of balloons for the number of students. Every day we pop a balloon and inside each balloon is a student's name. We celebrate that student for that day in Seesaw. You could also do this with name of wheels in Google. You could do it with just drawing kids' names out of a hat each day. So we celebrate those students in Seesaw by taking a smiling picture of them. We usually have a friend do this. And then that student and child get to add in their name. They get to choose their label style and add one emoji in about them. Then we put the iPad or computer at the back of the room and every student comes up and creates one label for that student and kind word to describe who they as, are as a person. They can even add an emoji. For younger students, in my past years, what I've done is put out a list of character traits for those students. When they get done with all the students adding one kind word about their friend, they get to hit the check mark and turn it in. So there's a few ways you can access this activity. You can go into the activity library where I have the activity called A Friend a Day in May, or every day you can simply pick a kid and click on the photo button and create your labels about that student. To add to this fun project or to turn it into a lasting memory, you can create a mini memory book by printing out the images from Seesaw and handing it out at the end of the year. You can add a teacher recording to each image and get the item QR in Seesaw to print and share with your kids. You could also save the images from Seesaw and create a mini movie for the students uh, to watch in Seesaw or even just to send home on a disc if you want to, to share with them. Thank you. If you have any questions, you can find me at Robin underscore S-C-H-U-H on Twitter. My emails are schumacher at cherrycreekschools.com. You can also check out my activity library, and I'm always adding lots of fun and creative stuff in there. Thank you for tuning in. I hope you have a great day or a great evening. Thanks.